Shalom and welcome back to the YouTube channel of Pastor Paul, Shofar Maker. And now here I have a one new man, Yemenite Shofar video 1537 J size completed with a menorah, menorah engraving. And a J size, anything is measured after 42 inches right up to 45 inches measured along the external curve of the Shofar. Yeah, to you the... Uh, tip of the bell side so the bell is clean up nicely and the mouthpiece will turn up nicely and this is a uh, full polish sofa full polish that means all round is full polish yeah you see that some some people have requested full polish so we have done it some full polish yeah so it's always different trends different times some Full natural, full polish, semi polish, full polish with the top here. Maintain natural also we have. Yeah, but this is a full, full polish. And uh, let's see the colors of this full polish so far. Their basic color here is uh, ivory cream color. Yeah, and uh, as we move on, you can see the uh, different layers of the shofar colors comes out. Yeah, you can see the coffee brown colors comes out here today. And then we see also the uh, maroon purplish colors comes out and uh, very nice, it's awesome color. If you like that, full polish, this is one for you. J size, yeah, it's lightweight. Yeah, lightweight, full polish. The uh, sound especially, I would say that uh, for, for a full polish uh, or a full natural, the sound variation is not a, a lot of different in the sense because what it's about the technique of uh, our fine tuning when we get the best sound from the horn yeah very nice huh so you can see this is a uh, published colors there all the way to the bell side and on the reverse side is also polished out yeah see that Ivory cream color, coffee brown color, and as we move on, why that this got the different colors? Because why when we sand it down, or we say we grind it down, the thickness of the sofa become thinner. Yeah, not that it become weaker, but it becomes thinner, and then the different layers of the growth of the horn comes out. The different layers, different colors. Yeah, so this one you can see, like this, see. Dark coffee brown, <clears throat> and then you see the maroon published colors comes out. Very nice, different patterns, different, different styles, patches here and there, stripes here and there. You see that? Yeah, like I say again, some people want to see natural, but some people say, oh no, I want it smooth. Yeah, you see, patterns, very nice patterns. Yeah, some people say, oh. When it's all smoothened out, then you say, oh, is it synthetic? No, no, it's a real, real antelope horn. Yeah, kudu horn. Yeah, it's just that when you, when you have uh, polished out, it looks like that. Yeah, it's so very nice here. One patch here as well. The maroon published colors. Yeah, just like that. There is some patterns there. I don't know, patterns. It looks like a butterfly. <laughs> yeah, with the feelers here. Butterfly, the wings. So, <clears throat> let's hear the sound of this particular J size video one five three seven. Wow! So you can hear the sound. The last note being the uh, high G. Wow, it's not easy to get, but uh, there is a high G there. Let me just try it again. Yeah, there's a high G there. Yeah, so this shofar becomes a, let's count the notes, low G. Basic C, middle G, 
high C, high E, and high G, which is a six note shofar. Yeah, this is a six note shofar. That means <clears throat> that means it has three octave of G, two octave of C, one high E. Yeah, so there's six notes for this uh, shofar. Uh, let's hear the sound of this, uh, the uh, running notes of this shofar. <laughs> Awesome running notes, you can hear that? And this is six tone shofar, yeah? So like I say just now, review it, rewind it. And hear the uh, sounds of the shofar coming out. Yeah, there's a uh, three octaves of G, three, two octaves of C, one high E. Yeah, so <clears throat> listen to it again. And as you have seen this particular uh, shofar and hear the sound being blown as my my way of blowing the shofar for my Lord and my God. Yeah. Review it and also give us a thumbs up. Yeah, because why we are giving just a like like that. It helps us plenty because we see our algorithm in our YouTube channel exposure changes, have more exposure. So thank you very much for, for watching and giving us a thumbs up and remember to subscribe and click that notification button and share. Share with never of friends <laughs> to encourage <clears throat> others to get a shofar somehow, somewhere and join in the worldwide army of shofar blowers. For our Lord, He is coming again. So what we can say is, Maranatha Lord, Maranatha, come O Lord, come. This is what the, the angelic hosts are also excited about and also calling out besides us who are the followers of our Lord Jesus Christ. Yeah. We thank you for your for your uh, support and uh, your prayer for us. Yeah. And just continue to say Maranatha, come O Lord, come. So thank you very much for watching and uh, we for helping us to increase our subscriber base and uh, really appreciate that. Yeah. Thank you for your prayers. God bless you all and shalom.